Now it's not math, science or the arts. Kolkata's iconic Presidency University, currently celebrating 200 years of existence, is also debating food. The Vice Chancellor wants a swanky food court serving Chinese, South Indian, Punjabi, Mughlai, Gujarati foods, you name it, all of it. But students want to save 40 years of heritage. Pranatha's canteen as iconic as the Presidency itself. You may find the fish fry greasy, momos rubbery, and chow mein china would disown. But Pranutta's canteen at Presidency is about soul food, not to be found at a food park the university wants instead. It's a college, it's not a mall that we need a food for. We need a canteen where we can sit, where we can, we can have a proper exchange of ideas, and that is what the promoter is providing us with. The authority is trying to corporatize the campus, which we are not supporting and we won't let it happen. Now, I'm not from the hallowed presidency, but being here at Pramod Das Canteen feels like I'm in a hall of fame. Alumni too are upset. I see a complete assault on presidency heritage. One of the last bastions of such heritage is Pramod Das Canteen. Why are you trying to change the ethos of, of the organization in the name of modernization? The vice chancellor dismisses conspiracy theories against Pranabda. All kinds of rumors are being flown around that we want to oust him, that with the uh, uh, price tag is too high. Not, nothing like that. 50 lakh rupees. Over a period of three years, which comes to a sale of 5,000 rupees a day. You think a canteen doesn't make that much? The tender says 50 lakh average annual turnover. Both are out of Pranavda's reach. The debate is snowballing and may end up at the door of the education minister next week. In Kolkata, Monadipa Banerjee, NDTV.